thesmartlocal.com Good morning. I am glad to be back. I'm excited because we are in front of something that I'm very, very, very excited about. Yeah. So, any guesses what you'll be doing today? Wow. Let me think. I think it's a tough guess, uh, guys. It's like if I look there, it's time zone. Uh. So, it's either I'm going to be like working at time zone or I will be, you know, part of the games. So, today you'll be joining the fun squad at time zone. Okay, I didn't know that there was such a thing called the Fun Squad but the last time that I actually went to an arcade was probably 20 years ago. I think at that point in time when I was growing up, right, there wasn't such a thing as, oh, like a PS5. So to enjoy ourselves, we would actually go to Time Zone to play arcade games like got the... Let's meet your mentor, Jeremy. Hello. Hi, Jeremy. Hi, I'm Jeremy. Yep. Nice to meet you. I'll be your mentor for today. Okay. So I'm a venue executive, also known as a supervisor. So we will usually delegate tasks to our fun squad members, and if they ever require any assistance, we'll be there to guide them. So on a day-to-day -day basis, usually we'll work with our technicians to perform game maintenance check, oh. and also we will work closely to ensure that the games provide a great guest experience. Oh. Mm. Then as the day progresses, we usually top up the games, that which I'll later teach you on how to do as well. Alright. Then also to assist the guests at the end of the day. Okay. Mm. Are you ready? Of course. All right, let's go. Let's get you changed. All right, let's go. A total of four zones. This is our very first zone. What we have here is our main attraction, which is Door Empire. Oh. So usually our fun squad members they are tasked to look at the games. They make sure it's top up and the playing field is also adjusted so that every guest will have their fair winning chance of getting a toy. Okay, okay, okay. So this is zone two. Mm -hmm. So our main attractions are usually Big Sweet Land uh -huh. and Arcadia, which later you experience. And then over here is our racing team. So if you like the thrill of racing, it actually provides a fun and competitive scene oh. and over here is more of the carnival games if you want to earn some tickets all right mm. then this is zone three okay so known for our cascade games and also our music games as well Wait, uh, cascade, mm. games. Our cascade games take it like a waterfall of items where if you reach the end of the pit, you get bonuses. Oh, cascade games. Yeah, I thought cascade, you know, like the... <laughs> so that's how I like to play. I challenge you. Can. <laughs> so the last zone is a mixture of classic games, mm -hmm. but the one that really attracts people is Hill Billy. The next one is where people always go to is the bumper car. Wow. Yes. All right. So with that being said, I hope mm. you're ready because okay. we're going to give you a challenge. Hope you have been listening. I have. I have. I'm very confident, especially after the workout just now. <laughs> I'm all pumped to be the part of the fun squad. So this is going to be our challenge. Okay. We're going to have to find all these games under three minutes three in minutes. the venue. Yes. So the challenge is going to start in three, two, one. Let's go. I spent him to find four. S for nine, legends, got it. I think he should be fine. He shouldn't struggle too much. Eh? Hey. Hey. I just did one round. I cannot even. He believes. He believes. Hungry hippo. Ha 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 ha! Dance, dance. Revolution. I'm left with oh. Oh, Hun, oh, Honito san. Oh, I feel, oh. Oh, Hunito san. What is demolition? I think, yeah. Where is this? How is demolition king? It's I sing. Uh, if you're watching this, uh, if you think that it is I sing, is it a king? Please subscribe and help me out. All right, so how do you do? I was sweating, but I got five. That's good. I was expecting you to get four. Wow! <laughs> I got all except for this. Demolition King. When you read, you see King or Icing? Okay, ah. I see King. I see King. It's actually right beside bumper car area. I exceed your expectation. Remarkable. Ah, remarkable. remarkable. 
All right, so welcome to our stock room. Mm -hmm. So this stock room consists of a lot of things. We got the big plushies. Then after that, we got the drinks as well. So all of them, you can actually find it in this stock room to fill it up at the claw games. Oh, okay, mm. okay, all right. For the games we're going to top up is the big sweet land. All so right. we're going to have to gather some of the items. Then we're going to top it up. So as an associate that completed five out of six in the previous challenge, can I get any prize? I can help you make it easier for you to win a prize lah. <laughs> okay, 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 it is on. I'm excited for that, okay. But first, we need to go and fill up the... Big Sweet Land. Ah, Big Sweet Land. Let's go. Alright, so this is Big Sweet Land. Mm -hmm. And this is where we're going to top up all the confectionaries and plush. We usually just remove the platform. Then we can start from scratch. So we'll try to do a display. Okay, okay. So usually I like to do it like this. One plush on top. Uh -huh. One plush at the bottom. Then eggs at the side. Confectionaries. And try to be cute a bit. You can put a box. Wow, must display everything. Yeah, so roughly something like that. Then for the playing field itself, we will try to adjust it in the middle so the school will actually be able to grab the plushies and drop ah. at the platform. So like how often do you restock? The rule of thumb is 60% confectionaries and 40% plushies. Oh, so we try not to overlook. Oh yeah, so cute this one. This one I put on top. Then I think kids will like the QQ one like this. Nice, you follow the colour. Ah, that is what I intended actually, the colour scheme. And then maybe you add a bit of a pop colour like a pink, some sweets to sprinkle at the top. Yeah, this plate. Oh, chocolate, this one, kinder very nice. This one, I think whoever that get this one, very lucky. <laughs> It's a wholesome, got nuts, got chocolate, got sweets, got plushy. Two tires she passed, but usually I try to avoid the wrapper. It gives a bit of a messy look, but that's still okay. Yeah, I'm more of a, uh, like an organized mess. Uh, okay, yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so after stocking up the games, we also have to ensure that the games are clean. Okay. Mm, so that's what we're going to be doing. Alright, okay. So basically, what I'm supposed to do is to make sure that it's safe for people to actually play the game. Therefore, I'm wiping like the uh, eh. So I'm wiping the areas where you know there is a lot of point of contact. This is called multitasking. You are resting, but at the same time you are also wiping. What wow, this one like? I wipe my own motorbike like that. That's yeah. I'm gonna be a marumpet for a minute, now, guys. Am I doing a good job? <laughs> okay, we are finally on our lunch break after all that running around. So Jeremy, as we eat our lunch, maybe mm. I'll you know chit chat with you a little bit. Yeah. You know, because like we must work with the supervisor very closely, oh. you know. So how long have you been working here actually? Around a year and a half already. Oh wow, that's pretty mm. long. Okay, by the way, can I dip some cheese sauce? Can, of course. <laughs> <laughs> So as a time zone employee, right, do we get to play the games for free? Every month you get a complimentary credit of $50. $50? Yes. Oh wow. Mm. So which game will give you the most tickets? <laughs> Hungry Hippo. Hungry Hippo? Yes, Hungry Hippo. Do you notice when you were at a venue, you smell something different? There's a scent. Um, the only thing I smell it's my own sweat from the running. <laughs> but there is like a fresh scent. It's sort of like a lavender smell. So some of the guests also will usually ask, uh, oh, uh, where's this supplier from? Where do you get this uh, scent? Oh, wow. Yeah. They actually ask about the scent of time zone. Mm. Oh, that's so interesting. I did not know that. <laughs> so weird. They ask about the scent, but they ask about, yeah, they they ask about right. the game. That's all that I have uh, for this interview. Uh. <laughs> we just have our lunch and then get ourselves energized for the next challenge. Okay, get fueled up. Yeah, that's the word. See, even when he's saying that he's smiling, guys. Maybe after this, I'll also be smiling. Ah. So this is the party room, mm -hmm. and I'll leave you to Ayu. So she'll be in charge of all the party items, the setting up. So I'll leave her to you. You'll be in good hands. Okay, I will not disappoint you, sir. No worries. Uh, party time! Today, we have a party going on at 4. I'm going to challenge you to set up exactly like in party room A to party room B. Wow. Yeah. Okay, this one half an hour, <laughs> one hour or...? Uh, no, it's just going to take about 5 to 10 minutes. 5 to 10 minutes, guys! Okay, she is a experienced party person. I am new, you know, but I will take the challenge up gladly. But actually, are you? how do I start? So, I will give you a list mm -hmm. and then you just follow the list. 
Yeah, oh. so you, there's no need for you to worry. Okay, okay, yeah. sounds, sounds pretty easy. All right, let's go. Okay, so based on the list, right, uh, it is Sarah's 8th birthday party, 15 packs. Tables are set up correctly and neatly, yeah, pretty much. That's amazing. 15 packs. Let me check if there's 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then I have to do this because I feel like they also put it 5. So you just display 5, 5, 5. First thing is to change from Benjamin to Sarah. S A A A. Wow. There's no A. Ah. So what I'm gonna use is I'm gonna use the add sign. Ah. Uh, she's a little bit quirky, she's fun. So the blues are well inflated. Room is clean, yes. 15 people. Ah. One, two, three. Okay, five. I will make it to ten. I'll make it to ten. Yeah, you do like flower pattern. Yeah, actually the other side empty. Ah. This one is the birthday girl and the family said. That one is the friends who she don't like. Since it's empty, I let, I let them read something. So it's surprise. I underneath. I think I put here. When she come, I hold. <laughs> All right, now that the party room is already done, uh, what do you guys think? A bit messy, but quite creative lah. I mean, in a logic where they can just like take anywhere they want to take. Yes, yeah. exactly. That was the concept of mine. Birthday should be free and easy. Everybody needs to be fair, right? I think you can actually put the sweets in a basket, give a more presentable look. Oh. But overall, I kind of get where you're going. Inspired by the big sweet land, the way you describe, <laughs> you know? Alright, so we have bowling alleys at Time Zone Ultra Exchange. So we got two types, one of the mini one, then another one is the interactive bowling. Oh, so do you have this in the other outlets? No, this one is one of the only ones now. Because I see the bowling alley got like lights. Huh? There are actually animations where you throw a ball, every ball is a different experience. Wow, that is actually really cool. It's like you have a game within a game. I don't know whether I want to play bowling, I want to play the game on the floor, I want to watch music video. But then you have another thing that is quite special here which is like games right so we got one function where you select the mad tunes you actually take a photo or a selfie then this animation or this character will actually do silly things whenever you score a strike oh my god can i try can of course okay there we go oh my god i can take my <laughs> so you gotta do the first one okay so you make a smiley then you shoot Okay. And then I have to do a set face. Yeah. This one is best side. My face is there. Ah! That's oh, a timer. Oh, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Allah. <laughs> it's my face. All right, so now we are at the back alley of uh, the bowling. Uh -huh. So usually that's where... I think you've never been here before also, right? No. So the ball that was stuck just now in my lane, you can actually take it out and rectify it. Okay. Okay. So usually this kind of error doesn't really occur, but when it does, we'll try to rectify it. Then once we're done, we can actually move on to the next exciting game, which is bumper car. Ooh, all right. Okay. All right, so welcome to the bumper car at Oxford yeah. Exchange. So this is the iconic one. A lot of guests would love to play this. Yeah. So your task today is gonna facilitate the games. You're gonna have to park the cars all the way back. Can I just push? I uh, know. <laughs> you're really? gonna have to ride it. What? Okay, okay, okay. I will do my best. I hope I don't take too long. Okay, I'm gonna start now. Okay. Must have a seatbelt for every bumper car. Yes, every wow. time. Well, wow, I think I would love to be on this station for my entire shift. A drift. Whoa, what a chill! All done, sir. Nice, did really well. Before every game starts, you have to read through a briefing. Then you have to use a mic because some guests may not be able to hear. Okay. So this helps to amplify your voice. Okay. So you can hold on to the script. Uh -huh. And then whenever you give an announcement or briefing, you have to sound lively. No, I will not embarrass you, don't worry. It's okay. Okay, ready. Welcome to uh, time. Uh, wait. Uh, no? uh, you need to activate it. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to Time Zone Orchard, our bumper car attraction. You are excited? To have you here today, let me just explain how to operate the bumper car to ensure that you have the best experience possible. To go forward, you will have to push both levers forward. If you guys have any issues, give me a wave and I will stop the ride. Are you guys ready to have a bumpy ride? Let me ask you again. Are you guys ready to have a bumpy ride? 
You out. Okay. That was good. So, good ah. That was good. Very energetic. Welcome to Arcadia, our last game. And then we have a few genre of games where you can get to play. So I'll be teaching you on how to set it up. Okay. So you're gonna need the controller. Okay. And then the weapon. So you just need to turn on the controller by holding down this button. Uh huh. Then just slot it in. Assemble. Okay. So that usually we have to facilitate a script in the back of our mind because there's no script like the bumper car. Mm -hmm. So depending on the games that they select, then from there we just come up with our own imagination. So for example, maybe like a pirate game, there will be a silent, a brief silent, then that's where you go. All right, uh, ahoy matey, welcome to the pirate ship. Are you feeling the ahoy matey? You must say it together with me, ahoy matey. Ahoy matey. Oh, okay, right. Let me just give you the gun first. All right. Set it up for you. Then you assist her to put on the headset. Okay, are you ready to get into the world of the pirate ahoy matey? <laughs> So All you can right. actually tighten and loosen. Okay, let me know when to stop. Do oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you feel comfortable, ma'am? Do you feel comfortable? Do you feel comfortable, milady? Yeah, okay. Usually you ask whether they can see anything inside as well. Oh. Can you also see anything inside, milady? I see mountains. Okay, that's okay, good. Okay, that is fantastic. Enjoy and may the quest be in your favor and may you turn out victorious. Go for it! Shoot! You're doing such a good job! Oh, Are you able to see a character? Yeah! Okay, then you can point it at it and then you push the trigger. Go forward! Turn around! Yeah, oh, you're doing a good yeah. job! <laughs> Alright, good job! Thank so, you! A few pointers to keep note. I believe that the way you structure it, it doesn't have to be too direct. Oh. It may be more imaginative. Oh. Like calling out directions. Oh, look to your left, look to your right. Go forward, turn around. Yeah, oh, you're doing a good job. Yeah. <laughs> Good afternoon everyone, I am Zane, a member of the Fun Squad and I would like to welcome you to Time Zone. Place to take time off and get in the zone. Brave the currents and reel in some of the strongest fishes on Ace Angler and soak in some water fun while hunting mythical dragons on Dragon Hunter. Thank you! It's okay, it's okay, it's fine, I'm gonna help you. Ah! Hey, you go, you wait, you wait. Alright, Zen, thank you so much for today. I really hope you learned a lot. Okay. Remarkable. It's one thing we achieved. You hear that? Remarkable. But I also want to say thank you so much, Jeremy, right. for having me at Time Zone and letting me be part of the fun squad. I think I really learned a lot from you today and I think you're an amazing supervisor. So thank you so much. And yeah, hopefully next time if I come here, I can find you. Can. For free game, huh? Mm -hmm. I'll see how. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm finally done for the day and honestly, it's been an incredible experience. I think it's really incredible how the fun squad really tried to immerse every every single customer into the games that they actually have. Like the fun squad is really a fun squad. Some of the interesting things that I picked up is how to actually fix the bowling ball if it gets stuck in like the pit or whatsoever. The other one was definitely making the announcement for the bumpy cars because there were a lot of specific instructions kind of tied to the safety of the bumpy cars itself. But I think the challenge is to make it really fun. So that's something that I learned today lah, to make sure that it is still safety briefing but at the same time, fun. Good job for today's day. Since you worked so hard, we're gonna let you play hard too. Oh my god! How much is inside? Two hundred dollars. What? Thank you for watching this episode of The Part Timer. In light of TSL celebrating our 10th year anniversary, we have partnered with Time Zone for a special giveaway. So check out the pinned comment in the comment sections down below to see how you can stand a chance to win. And as always, if you like this video, please remember to like, share, subscribe. Don't forget to ring the notification bell over here and watch our other videos over there. Now it's my time to play. <laughs> Whoa!